So what I have here is a secant of theta is equal to 8. And tangent of theta is equal to 3 root 7. Find the cosecant theta. So the cosecant is equal to 1 over the sine theta. So 1 over cosine, which is the secant theta, is equal to 8. So that means that cosine theta is equal to 1 over 8. The tangent theta is equal to 3 root 7. So that means that... Um, So this is going to be in quadrant one. This is three root seven. This is one, and this is eight. So if it helps to see this, um, because uh, excuse me, let me. I'm, I know what I'm doing. I just want to make sure this is explained correctly. So opposite over adjacent. So that's why I got the one there. So that matches up opposite over adjacent. All right, so we want to find the cosecant theta, which is equal to one over cosine theta, or not cosine, sine theta. So this can be equal to one over um, one over eight. 1 over 8, sorry, uh, 3 root 7 over 8, and then it gets reciprocated um, to get the cosecant, so we get 8 over 3 root 7, and then multiply, rationalize the denominator, so we get the cosecant theta is equal to 8 root 7 over 3, uh, root 7 times root 7, 7, so it's equal to 21. Um, that's it.